Hello everyone and welcome back to Europa Universalis 4 as Brandenburg. We are as always gaming by gaslight and it's been kind of a crazy weekend since uh, pretty much I have not been able to access the internet at all. For some reason it just disappeared. And uh, because of that I really haven't been able to do anything besides, uh, let's see here, influence, can we enforce peace? Oh, and Mecklenburg doesn't even like us that much. Come on, Mecklenburg, work with me here, I am trying to protect you. Anyway, yeah, so basically I've had nothing to do but kind of run like an endless series of test games and whatnot, just seeing... Like, just watching to see how things would play out when doing... Oh, as you can see here, we started a new session, so things have gone different. Uh, uh, as I suspected from the end of last game, Sweden is now trying to siege us. And I feel like we should go on over here and maybe try something. I hope Sweden doesn't come in to attack us while we're doing this. Because I'm not really interested in fighting Sweden right now. What I am interested in is them going away, maybe. And also with us rebuilding our stuff. Another important thing. Uh, let's work on building ships. I mean, we're at war, and while we have all this nonsense to deal with, there's not much we can do as far as actually... Uh, like sending our ships out to sea to take care of stuff, but we should be able to like work on rebuilding our navy for the sake of eventually, hopefully. Wait, why'd you guys leave? Why did you leave over here? What are you doing? Oh, you're going to fight Sweden. I'll I'll get a piece of that action because why not? Right? There we go. Mm mm mm. Tasty, tasty. Okay, good. Alright, so we... Oh yeah, another important thing that I forgot to mention is Sweden actually doesn't really have any manpower, so any, uh... Oh, they've taken Slesvig back, unfortunately for me. Uh, we will improve this, because this war may not go anywhere, and we're not going to be the ones making the peace, so we won't have to spend the diplomatic power. At least, that's the idea. Okay, seriously, no one doing anything over here? <sighs> Alright, it's up to me. Again, as usual. Like, could you guys n maybe not just sit there? Oh, now you're... And now you're standing on top of me, so that you're basically increasing our group attrition. Oh, now that I'm going over here... Wait, oh, it's because I have attached to this unit on. That's the problem. No, 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 no. What? Hey, hey, don't, don't, don't do that. I'm pretty sure I'm building a ship there, and if you capture that before I get there... You son of a bitch. You just had to do that to me. You stole my ship from me. Again, we did turn this off, right? Like, I don't want you following me. I want you to go smashing other... Yeah, other stuff. Like, let's see here. Um, I, I, I'll be honest, I don't really care what you take, just... Go and do something so that... You know, we're actually getting stuff done here. I want this war to end someday, you know? Where are you going? Oh. Squish. Excellent. And you know what, we'll take this. And get out of there. So I want to minimize my attrition. Oh, Sweden's coming in. No, no, don't, don't stand there. I'm already the one who's on top of that. Wait, what are you doing? Sometimes. Oh, technology. Oh, right, we're behind the time on this. I shouldn't have taken that idea. But we will take this, 
And for our next idea group, I think we're going to take a military idea. And part of me wants to take quantity, part of me wants to take quality, and part of me wants to take defensive, and another wants offensive. I mean, there's really no bad choices, it just comes down really to like what you want at any particular time. And I, mean, I like a lot of the ideas of defensive, but I almost feel like quantity is the way to go right now, because it'll give us more manpower, it'll give us more re manpower recovery and other things, so we can basically get more units. Quality will make us get better units, and so on and so forth. Of course, if we finish quality, we get extra discipline, and that is rather appealing. But then again, so is building all of this. Because at the end of it, we get enemy attrition is increased, and lower attrition for ourselves, which is very important since we keep blowing through manpower. Mostly because we keep taking on enemies who, you know what, that, we're going to take defensive. I keep flip-flopping on them. Are you serious? Are you serious, Hoss? Alright. Uh, detach a siege, and send everyone else in. And even that might not be enough, but it was. It was the best of times, it was the worst of times. What's this? Imperial Liberation. Now we could go for that. I also feel that, uh... Where are you going? Oh, you're gonna smash them, okay. Our truce with the Ottomans and Tunis has ended. Oh, they're coming in. Oh, they're trying to resiege that. I'll just let these guys go around. Oh, Saxony declare... Oh, my god. Why do you guys have to keep... Declaring wars on people? Where's my Emperor actions? Emperor actions. You, sir. Return the unlawful territory that does not really belong to you. You're gonna deny me, but at least it gives me a right to go to war. Oh, and we also have no one actually doing anything. Okay, we fabricated all the claims on you. Uh, let's keep fabricating claims. Oh, we're at war with them, so we can't. Okay. Uh, let's improve relations with Bavaria, because they're actually... They're kind of like the traitors of the HRE, because they don't really... Oh, we also aren't doing anything with Switzerland. Alright, let's improve your relations. Because we're not leaving... This war's not ending until Pomerania says they're done, so... Yeah, we just have to sit here and take it. What's this? Ah, oh, our general died. No! I think he had siege abilities. I don't know if he did or not. I think he did, because that just went down. Oh! Also, we're sort of increasing our ships. Let's continue doing that. Wait, are we making money? We're sort of making money. This is probably a bad idea, but I'm gonna keep building ships anyway. Because someday this war will end, and when that day comes, we will be- oh, what's this? Land technology research is useless. Um... No. Stop, stop doing that. I keep axing. You kidding me? You lost? Come on! Alright, I'll have to wait for them to come back, and then we'll go to war. Listen, I appreciate your vigor. That's right. Oh, and they declared peace. They gave Colm to us. And that's pretty much all that happened. So that was not the most profitable war as far as wars go. But we did complete our mission. So, uh, we'll choose create a proper fleet, because in recovering our manpower, that's just never gonna happen. Like, ever. Ever, I, I tell you. We will never be at full manpower. Ever. Never gonna happen. Can't, won't, mustn't. But that is the end of one war, and fortunately it looks like there are no other wars going on right now. Though eventually we will want to go to war over here, and maybe with Saxony, since they seem to be attacking people. There's a whole bunch of people just stacking up over there. 
If I declared war on Saxony right now, there'd be like some kind of imperial defense. Oh, I don't have any diplomats to send, so I can't find out. That's unfortunate. Yeah, we had so many more navies at one point. We're only making 0.92. But I believe that's mostly because it's costing us money to reinforce our army. But since there's no wars going on, at least that means we don't really have to worry about- Oh, what's this? Stop trying to improve relations with Hayno. Yeah, that's good. And, uh, we are not going to go to war for you, sir. But we are going to fabricate claims on your country. Because someday it will be our country. I promise, I'm going to cut Sweden down to size at some point. What says Sweden has declared us rivals? Okay, so they clearly heard my boasting. Okay. So we're actually almost back to full, as far as manpower is concerned. We're going to want to invest in more cannons when the opportunity arrives. Okay, almost. Oh, also, I think we can start the coring process. Excellent. Excellent. We just need two more men. And we are rebuilding our manpower. We have a maximum of 39,000. So, all in all, let's uh, just ratchet speed up here, because nothing else is going... Oh. Protect trade in Lubeck. Good. We can invest in an idea. And you know what? We're going to take it. Extra army tradition. Huzzah. I can't wait until we get some of these. Morale. Army tradition decay decrease. Infantry combat. It should be glorious. Oh, what's this? We've been caught in Finn. Eh. I don't care. What's this? Imperial liberation against the Hess. Eh, we'll let that go. What's this? Truce has ended. Which means we could declare war against Poland again. Huzzah! But, uh... See, see, Bavaria will come in. The traitorous, traitorous Bavaria. Man. I'm sure there was a time we were making more money. What's this? Gain army tradition? Or just... Um, okay. Uh... What is our tradition in the Navy? So we'd pretty much lose all our naval tradition. Hmm. I have to be honest, I am... I'm not... I don't really care that much about it. We will recall our diplomat. Um... Let's see. Oop. Lock that. Nope. Yeah. Lock that. I want that to stay open when I... No, no, lock it. Thank you. Alright, who can we improve relationships with that we really care about? There's Milan. Uh, there's Nuremberg. The Nurembergers do not like us for some reason. Do, 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 do. Possibly because we keep calling them Nurembergers. As if they're some kind of tasty burger of some sort. What's it? Oh my god, what happened? Bohemia is requesting that we come to their aid in the Polish conquest. Damn you, Bavaria. Oh, we're in. Because that just means more conquest for us. Ah, we'll call in Mazovia. And Cologne. I and mean, we're defending the Empire, which means that we're gonna get all that sweet, sweet, uh, Imperial authority and stuff. I'm pretty sure we're actually getting Imperial, infor uh, imperial authority for helping. And well, if Austria on our side, we can't lose. Right? Let's see here. Janissaries. Something about continuing building Janissaries. There's gonna be a smashing going on. Okay, you know what? Let's, uh, let's actually go in. How's the war looking like? Hmm. Also, you know what? Uh, what I... No. Go here first. What I meant to do is, um, where's their prestige? Prestige. Prestige. Oh, their prestige is actually negative 24, which means... Do they have a personal union with uh, Lithuania? No, they do not. Just an alliance. You know, 
I should... We're not the leader in this war, are we? We are not the leader in this war. Okay. Bohemia, I know you're the AI, and you can be kind of stupid sometimes, but what you've really got to do here is... Are you, are you doing anything? I don't know if you're doing anything. But what you have to do is break their alliance with Lithuania and with Bavaria, so that we don't have to deal with this nonsense again. Alright. Oh, dear. I see guys coming in. I don't like these guys coming in. We're gonna try to counterattack them. Yeah, they're, they're up to something. We'll sit here. Oh. Um. Alright, we'll move in. Oh. Oh no, they think they can take us, apparently. Oh. And they changed their mind. Excellent. Okay. Everyone come on in. Come together now. Where are you going? Now, will we have to cross a river to get here? Between here and... Yes. Yes, we will. So let's, uh... Try getting in here. Yep. Oh, and they're trying to run. Yes. Wait, we're not winning. We're not winning! Wait, wait. Yes, we're winning! That was a much worse fight than it could have been. Let's see here. Krakow has it. Alright. Could I make this someone's, uh... Okay, I don't know if... Is anyone sitting there to make a... To actually try f capturing it? Because we have to organize our, our stuff here. Like, what are we doing? Is anyone going to take Krakow? Is it up to me to take Krakow? Apparently it's up to me to take Krakow. It always is up to me. Alright, attach a siege and roll on over. Squish. No, no, don't... Don't sit there, dash it all. Attach a siege, squish that, and then come back. Oh dear. Where are you going? I don't like this. Oh, they're fighting. Okay, we've taken this. I'm gonna go take Lublin now. Which may be a bad idea. But, uh, we don't have time to... Where are you going? Radibor? Okay, so they're probably just gonna try taking their... Their war goal. Actually, let's do this. And we'll go over there. No, they're just sitting there. Oh. They're coming for me. Oh, what's this? The very accepted peace. Good! What? What? It, it showed us we were getting out of that province. It lied. hate it when it does that. Is there anyone in this war who actually has a, a navy? Apparently not. So, alright, just remind me to put these guys back. Oh, Brunswick is no longer a valid rival. That's okay. I didn't really want Brunswick to be a rival anyway. Let's see, how much money are we making? We are actually losing money. <sighs> Alright, raise the war taxes. We're still losing money, though. Oh, dear. Oh, and they're still gonna win. Oh, wait. A thought just occurs to me. Poland, uh, what tech group are you in? They're in Eastern, so they're actually slightly less good than us. I am glad to know this. Oh, oh apparently Bohemia wants that land. I suppose you're entitled to it. You can take it if that's what you want. I'm hoping they'll give me these two pro- Oh, what's this? Unlawful territory? By Brabant? You know I'm gonna demand it. You're not gonna give it to me, but... I am going to gather- or ask for it. I don't know if that's, like, actually- Oh, good. Which should, hopefully. Coleman Danzig. Seven years, 19 years. Alright, so there's... It's unlikely we're actually going to see a war there anytime soon. It also occurs to me, looking at how everything's going here, we could probably... 
like, back out of this and not fight anymore. If we really want it. Let's, uh, speed things up. Because this... Oh. Where are you going? Oh, they're trying to take the war goal. Don't worry, I'll take it back as soon as we finish capturing this province. Or if you guys get it first. Oh no, not Silesia. Oh yeah, they're just going to take it back. Nice. Okay, hurry up and capture that, would you? Are you, uh, where are you going? You're going somewhere. Oh, what's this? Renaissance Prince. Okay. Yes, we'll support the art. Um, yes, 500 and... Wow, that took a really long time. Now, part of me wants to rush in and try... Where's, like, the rivers on this? Um... There's no river between here, unless I misread that. So we'll go up here, then over here, and hopefully we can do something, maybe? Oh, good! Peasant Rebels. Okay, do we want to move in? My instinct tells me this is probably a bad idea. We're gonna do it anyway. Yeah! Take it! Take all of it! Hmm. Yeah, victory. Uh, you know what, we're also gonna... Yes! The war is over! Huzzah! And they gave us the provinces. Let's see. Sierra is in Lexiga. Oh, Lenschitza. Lenschitza is what it's pronounced in a more Germanic, I guess. Oh, that's interesting. That's something I forgot to mention, is that um, I have the option turned on so that like the names of provinces will change dynamically based on who owns them. In some places, it's a lot more noticeable than others. I'm probably still pronouncing this wrong. Lenschitza. Lenschitza. I'm, tr I'm trying. And what is this? Shiarts? Or Shirats? I'm, I'm so sorry for butchering your language. I'm so sorry. <laughs> or, well yeah, your language and your culture. I'm, I'm trying. It's not that good, but I'm trying. Okay, so we've basically, we've hurt them pretty good. Pretty good. Nice. Who do we want to add as our third rival? Um... Uh, I feel doing this with Sweden, since they're so much more powerful than us, is probably a bad idea. But they already rivaled us, so we can rival them right back. Take that. Neener, 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 neener. Uh, yes. Also, it's probably time to wrap this episode up, so I'm going to, uh, as soon as we can... Oh, we don't have conquest against Poland anymore? Oh, that's too bad. Also, I don't think they were intelligent enough to smash the alliance there, so let's uh, keep fabricating claims on Krakow. You see, if I was the one leading this war, we would have done things much more intelligent. We would have been breaking, uh, breaking alliances and stuff. At least I, I tell myself that I would be doing things much more intelligently, but... Uh, I can't really prove that, can I? We are going to build more boats, and eventually we are going to build more soldiers. And we do need to core our new provinces. Which one of these did we... Okay, we'll, we'll stand over here. Yeah, but yes, it's time to wrap this episode up, so I will pause here before I get distracted by any more complicated political maneuverings. And I'll just like to say, as always, thank you all for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't done so already. Your support really does mean a lot. And next time, we will carry on and do our best to try making the Empire the best damn place that we can. Hope to see you then.